everyone awesome? My name is Icarus Gomu and welcome back to Resident Evil 7. I'm ready to just go out, get some body parts, and make it into a nice old serum for us here at the party house of Raw. There's a hat. That must belong to the manly man, the youngest man of the house. October 11th, my ears have been ringing all day and I haven't been able to sleep since the child w showed up. It's like Zoe says, there's something strange about the child and the woman she brought with her. Yes, we just brought her into our home as an orphan and things haven't been the same since. She is up all night partying and causes many, many of us to lose many, many hours. I'm seeing things, hearing things, can't stop feeling nauseous. And went to the, see the doctor in town and he gave me an x-ray. What is happening to me? The child gave me a present. It was a child. A child of the child. I put the present in the secret room right to at the back of the second floor where nobody will find it. That arm is a sign of the child's trust. That arm will lead us to happiness. And anyone who corrupts that happiness, I won't allow them to live. Oh. Secret room right at the back of the second floor. Okay. Well, you do realize that if you don't want anybody to find it, you probably shouldn't leave it in such a, a notebook where it's nice out there and in the open for me and anybody else to read. Yeah, kind of a design flaw on your end. Well, at least now we know where to get the head. I just realized that there was something disgusting in the garbage. This is gross. I mean, I think it's a dog. Could be a rat. Either which way, ew, that's disgusting. Who's there? I got bullets and I ain't afraid to use them. Oh, it's just a lantern. I knew I'd heard a lantern. Oh, it's also this thing. A I kill, I kill bobbleheads, kill them good. Oh, and it, oh cool, well, only five more and then we get a magnum. Boom, boom, baby. Oh, we gotta balance this thing out with what? Burner nozzle? No. What can we balance it out with that's useless? The crank? No. I, I don't know what the game wants of me here. I mean, I kinda get it. I know I gotta put something there, but what? But what? The scorpion key? Are we gonna really need that anymore? I don't know. Do you know? I'm not sure. I'm not even 100% positive. The scale and the door seem to be connected. No shit, Sherlock. Well, obviously we need some sort of piece from somewhere else. Maybe we could take this corpse and use that. Perhaps that could be a thing. Come on, Ethan. Don't be a puss puss. Pick it up, put it on the other end of the scale, and balance it out. Balance that shit out good. Make it great. Hmm, maybe... You stay the fuck down there and you stay dead. Hello? You fucker. You're not dead. You're not dead. Does this game expect me to follow her? Because I don't want to follow her. I really don't. I'm really wishing I wouldn't have to. Games probably want me to. Ethan's morbid curiosity, not my own. <laughs> well, goodbye, mother. God. Fuck. Well, that's special. Oh, very special. Very special indeed. It kind of reminds me of Lisa from Evil De The Evil Within. And her creepy ass. Why am I even following her? Are you stupid? Is it worth the turmoil that you're going to suffer? You're almost dead as it is, Ethan. One leg, Ethan. Half life, Ethan. Half dead, Ethan. Ethan, the half dead man. Where the hell are we? Map. Map that knows all. Tell me. We're in the old, old house yard. Okay, cool. So we can unlock the back of the gate now. Sweet. 
Well, now we can go back to the trailer and we can put some money towards the Magnum. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds right. That sounds good. Why don't we do that? Oh, we were six away from it. Well, shit. Just another six more. And we'll have ourselves a kick-ass gun. Yep. Okay, let's check the chest. Do we have anything that could balance it out, maybe? I mean, I could put the burner nozzle back in. Can I actually combine those now? Into a badass flamethrower? Because I got the grip. Oh, I don't have the trigger. Ain't that just a load of crock and shit? Well. Uh, oh! I didn't need the trigger, apparently. Apparently, that all just makes it. Cool. I got a gun. It burns things. Don't call me a necrophile. I am not a necrophile, I swear. I promise. I only like to burn things just a little bit. Okay. Do we have anything else in the back? The basket of loveliness? We have a broken handgun. Which I was given some advice. That I missed something in this yard. Somewhere over here. There's supposed to be something that I missed. Oh, what is this? I don't know what this is. But there's also... Hmm. One, three, five, seven, nine. Trying to fade that shit out on me? I can understand what it is. I don't know what code it's requiring, though. Hmm. And then there's this thing. I don't know what this is asking for. All very puzzling things that... Oh. Oh. Oh, it's a projector thing. If I could figure out how to get it lit. Get it lit up in here with this biznitch. Then we could do that. Okay. I'm feeling a little bit more confident now that we have a burner. I'm feeling like we could potentially just put Mother down for good. Once and for all. What is out here? Wind! Shut up! Fucking wind is scaring me. Okay. Oh, a treasure photo. Yes! A toilet. A toilet. Where have I seen a toilet? Um. Let's examine this a little closer. It's a toilet with a lot of cigarettes. Could that be the bathroom in the upstairs of the house? I mean, there could only be so many bathrooms, right? Is there any hint on the back? I had something nice here. Try and find it if you can. Well, okay, getting sidetracked, but you know what? It could be something good. Last time we got steroids. This time we're going to go for a hunt. We're going to see what we... Oh, I was kind of hoping because... Yeah. I think you were going know where I'm going with that. Oh, there's psychonauts there. Wait, why can't I pick them? Psychonauts don't stack? Oh. Oh, there's supplements. Well, I used it now. I guess we could just look for things. Cool. Anyways, we're gonna go back in the house really quick. We're gonna search for that item. Let's see if we can find it. Because I bet you it's in the upstairs. Did I miss something on the floor here? Oh, I did. It's an antique coin. Well, at least I don't know where it is. Cool. And there's a herb here. I'm just, I just missed a bunch of shit. Oh, where are you? Oh. Oh. Oh, I missed like a crap ton of stuff. Huh. Huh, huh. Well. The treasure hunt, for one thing, became a treasure hunt for three things. Oh, right. The broken shotgun. I don't need that. Who needs a broken shotgun? The shotgun's broken. Nobody can use that thing. Hello? I still don't have a snake key, so I can't get in that door. But that's not important, because I'm just coming to this bathroom to check out the bathroom. Hmm. Okay, maybe not. That was a wasted trip. I thought maybe there would be something in there. 
Might as well check that to make sure we got everything, huh? Maybe it's a, it could have been a bathroom inside of the old house. If so, forgive me, for I have been a stupid. But at least we found some other things, and I'm not lollygagging, I swear. There's a couple of things that I missed, apparently, in there, but I won't hold this up. Pretty sure the tub, or the toilet, that we're looking for is in the old house. Anyways, um, I probably could do with putting away the crank. Oh, look. Some more stuff here. Oh, look. Bobblehead. Yay. It's like a venture to kill all the bobbleheads, I swear. They will all die, and they will all suffer. Okay, so the backpack did only increase my thing by, like, ten. And I, I have a pretty good idea of what the, the toilet looked like, so we're good on that end. Yep. Okay. Let us pick up the herb and make a nice bit of medicine with it. Also, we'll pick up the antique coin and use that. Because why not? We already spent all the other ones. Might as well use this one too. And then we'll go back to the old house and we'll check that out. And progress on the magnum. Mom would be proud. We're spending our money so wisely. Oh, let's grab this chem fluid as well. Because we still have a space. So we can pick up that treasure. Whatever it may be. Helped us last time, it'll help us this time. Actually, I don't want to go back through that tunnel. So let's go the easy way back to the old house. Across the bridge and through the door. To mother's old house we go. Hey ho, hey ho, let's go. Straight dough. Right down the mother's main hole. Can I cut one of these things? Nope. Thought I could. I tried it. No. Can't do it. Okay. There's gotta be a bathroom in this house somewhere. And I will find it. Or else my name is not P Jiddly Diddly Bathroom Finder Fiddly. Which it's not. So, yeah. I don't believe this was the bathroom. No. And there's no toilet in it. Maybe this treasure hunt is just not even worth it. Because we just went in a full circle. You know what? Let's just go hunt us a mother. We know, we we have an idea of where the treasure is. We found some other things in the meantime. Let's just go. Go and kick some mother ass. Oh god! That's one way to get down the ladder. Not exactly what I had in mind, but sure. That works. Okay. We may actually end up making more burner fuel, just because. Because we don't have a grenade launcher yet. So what's the point of making grenade launcher bullets if we don't have a grenade launcher to go with them? That's my thought on it anyways. And half-dead Ethan agrees. Okay. So... Oh, that's the greenhouse. And I don't know what that goes to. But let's see if we can get in the greenhouse, shall we? Oh, it's locked from the other side. Guess we're not going there, huh? Cool. Anyways, Psychonauts were such a nice adventure before. There's gotta be something hidden in the grass here, right? I could be wrong. And I could have just wasted our Psychonauts. Cool. If so, I'm sorry. Stay the fuck down there. I'll burn you. I'm not afraid to burn a mother. And yes, I hear your frickin' lantern. Oh look, more herbs. That's great. Some solid fuel, I can make some burner fluid out of that. All right, separating agent. Ooh, yes, please. Hello, what do we have? Flame rounds? Are you going to give me a freaking grenade launcher? Because if not, what was the point? Like, you shouldn't have if that's the case. 
I don't think there's anything else because the Psychonauts aren't really showing me anything. Hmm. I can break these, right? Nope. Oh, game! You want me to jump down there? You want me to jump down there with the moaning, groaning mother of a freaking creature of disgustingness? Okay. Not even gonna look. I know you're down here. I know you're down here. Only because I can hear your lantern. Oh, I need your lantern to balance out the scale. It just a freaking occurred to me. All right. Well, this has become a vendetta for my own adventure. Where are you? Or just keep running away from me. I like that idea. I like it a lot. I mean, it sounds good to me. You just keep running. I just keep killing. What's up with this hole? What do I do with it? Apparently nothing. Shut your dirty whore mouth. I mean, I'm getting closer. This I know, because I can hear that lantern squeaking more and more. Probably use this. It's locked from the other side. Probably use the Psychonauts once I kill Mother. That way they're not really wasted. Oh! That's really effective. Sweet. And I wasn't joking. That was very effective. I don't have to worry about the bugs anymore because it's super damn easy. Really wish you didn't give me freaking flame rounds right now, game, because I really could use the spot to take this strong chem fluid and make really powerful rounds. If I had... Okay, I guess it doesn't really matter because I would need... Oh. I'm trying not to waste too much of the ammo. There we go. Gonna just reload that again. Yep, make sure we're in tip-top shape for whatever's coming. Okay. Alright. Don't know what I was expecting. And we went in a full circle. Cool. Aren't you pissed that I killed your little babies? I did flame them pretty hard. Like, pretty oh, you're upstairs, aren't you? Okay. Knock, knock, bitch! Landor, in your face! Damn, you scared the shit out of me! I'm gonna burn your face! If it works good on bugs, it works good on your ass, too! Because, goddamn, you are the mother of bugs! Ugh! I was about to say. But the, uh, exterminator's in the house. Oh, should I use one of the health kits now? I really didn't think about that, but I probably might. Burn these guys off. Hey, more solid fuel. Now if I just find... If I could just find a nice little bit of... Chem fluid. I may be able to go off and get more... Health? See you, Wes. Hello! Allow me to assist you in burning! Ha ha! You are fucking disgusting. I'ma kill you. I'ma kill you, and I'ma kill you good. How do you, how do you like that? How does that sound? You're just plain out disgusting. Look at you. You really let yourself go. Ow, you little son of a... I mean, daughter of a... I mean, creature of a... What? What are you, anyways? Get off of me, please! I am trying to heal! I'm just gonna burn you. How does that sound? Like, if you're up on a wall, I'm just gonna get... Behind something? Where did you go? If your plan was to make it so I couldn't heal anymore, well, good job. Because I'm completely out of health. 
Are you giving birth to something? Hello? Oh, you gave birth to a bug. Okay. Do you know what bugs do when they're hit with fire? They burn. And they burn good. Did you just fall down the stairs? Yeah, that's right. You run. You run. And you know who the freaking boss is. It's daddy. Daddy's in the house. Where did you go and what are you doing? Mm. Okay, you're having another bug and that it does not sound good. Oh, fell down a hole again. Hello! It seems that I found you and your nest. Your nest that is susceptible to fire. Lots and lots of fire. If it would die. Am I doing this right? I feel like I'm failing as an exterminator here. And I... Where are you? Oh, there you are! I'm good. Oh, what the hell are you doing? Um, um, bullets! Yes! No, no, no. I, I scampered out. Oh, what's the matter? You can't reach me from there. Oh, too bad. Oh, fuck. You followed me down here. What are you? What are you doing? Are you dead yet? I gotta shoot you in the, uh, well, the baby maker, as they would say. I have one bullet left. I have... I have n oh, I have shotgun rounds. When did I get shotgun rounds? Why didn't anybody tell me I got shotgun rounds? The like number two go to for exterminators. No mother, no mother. Die please mother. Are you dead mother? Are you a dead mother? Please tell, you're not a, you're not a dead mother. Now where are you going? Ugh. Fucking creep. There you are! That's right. That's right. Oh no no no! Ah! She bit me! I'm infected now! That's just great. I'm out of ammo. Not? Not out of ammo. I found rounds. Just sitting there waiting for me to pick them up. Hello. No, you don't. You need to die within these next this next shot. Are you dead? Nope. You're not dead. Gonna run now. Hey, you remember those psychonaut things? I could really use those right now. Yep. Wait, don't I have some? Yeah. I think I picked up health. Yep. Oh, great. I fell down a hole. Why are there so many goddamn holes? Meanwhile, mother's somewhere having a freaking child. Again. No, you don't. Ah! I can't believe I have to resort to cutting you. It's really kind of nasty. Really kind of disgusting. Ah, it's just like the freaking fight with... Ow. Ooh, what's this? Gift? What gift? I don't want a gift. All I want to do is climb this ladder, please. You gonna jump up here? Yep, just like any good freaking horror boss would do. I'm just gonna cut you, all right? Going to cut you just a little bit. Right on the backside. Are you dead? I can make noises like that too. Oh, she became petrified. What the hell? Oh! She is crumbling. 
can stay dead, okay? I knew I needed that from you. Well, that is the second boss I've had to kill with a knife. Good to know I am 100% badass and none of the percentage of wimp. Where the hell was all of <coughs> this shit when I needed it? Oh look! Burner fuel! Psychonauts really pulled it out of the frickin' bag on that one, didn't it? And chem fluid. Cool. Well, if I just reload, then that burner fluid... Oh, never mind. That was a lot of burner fluid, actually. I really want these chem fluids. What, what do I do? Because I really want them. I really, really need them, actually. Hmm. Alright, I guess we could come back for them at some point. If need be. Hmm. Mother is dead. You know, at first I thought, oh hey. Oh. Oh, okay. Mother was doing that. At first I thought, hey. You know, it's gonna be easy to find that treasure from the frickin' toilet. Oh yeah. No, it's a piece of cake. No. No, they got freaking toilets just randomly strewn about here. Yeah. Okay. Might be unethical, but I'm going to use the first, the health. So I can get more ammo for this. So I can reload that. And, um. I have way too much burner fuel on, or solid fuel on me. I really do. Eh. Whatever. Because you know what? We made it out. Mother is completely and utterly dead, taken out of the equation. Although, I guess, because Evelyn wants us, me, and Mia to be mother and dad, or daddy and mommy, that makes, uh, what's her face? Marguerite. Mother. That makes her grandmother. So, yeah. Hmm. I'm just going to put that away, put those away. And keep everything else, because everything else is vital. This was the bathroom! Well, good to know the toilet was actually in a bathroom and not sitting somewhere else random. I found magnum ammo. Don't really need it right now, because we don't even have a magnum. Hmm. That's cool. Give me a second, I want to test something out. Is there a way that I could use the lantern here? Because I know that one says it's a combination. And then, there's also this thing that doesn't want to open up. Even though, hmm. Oh. So I can't, I can use the lantern here. But is it ethical to use the lantern here? Am I supposed to use the lantern here? I mean, it gives off a light. And it has a shadow. But I'm gonna guess no. <laughs> what, if, what was even the point? Like, what, what would I even begin to use there? We have more stuff in here than we we did. I feel like we have more stuff in here than we did. What would we even use? The broken handgun? Maybe. Let's see. I don't know. We're just in a testing mood today. So let's just try it out. Maybe if I spin it now. No. No. <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> I don't understand this at all. Like, there's no clear indication as to what goes there. It's just a faint, like, seven. So whatever I get that looks like a seven, I guess, would go there. But I'm not 100% sure. Anyways, we're gonna continue onward. 
We got the ammo. We got stuff. Whatever. I don't need to come back here. Unless I go back for the chem fluids, which I really don't want to right now. Um, although, we, wait, we have chem fluids. Hmm. So maybe, as I think about what I've actually accomplished in these few minutes after... Oh. Strong chem fluid. Huh. How did I miss that? Anyways, as we sit here and I reflect on the few minutes that I've taken after killing Marguerite... Why do I still hear a lantern? You know, I don't like it when I... Kill a boss and then things are still making noises. It's not fun. Well, look at that. It's a good thing I did come back. Because there was strong chem fluid. You know, I... St I still get this weary feeling that something is in here. Even though I killed her. How do I not have enough space? Oh, strong chem fluid doesn't stack. That's cool. That's great. All right. Okay, well, we can make this. Why not? And then we can grab that and take it with us. Because, hey, when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. Or at least that's usually the staying. In this case, you just get the fuck out because who's got time for making lemonades when everything's a goddamn monster? When everyone is mutating and turning into biological creatures? You know, this only makes me speculate. Is Daddy gonna come back again? Because we didn't petrify Daddy. I mean, it must, it must depend on their will. Like their strength, their will to live. As far as how they die and when they die. Hmm. I don't know. Food for thought. You know, I was thinking, maybe we could put the keys in front of that light and it ends up making a seven. Because that's a little bit more in the shape of a seven. Or at least that's what I'm feeling. But then again, I also feel like somebody else is going to give me a little visit while I'm in here. And uh, that's probably not wrong. It's probably very spot on, actually. Spot on. Apply directly to plot holes. Ah, oh, great. Who the heck is in there playing the piano? You want to show yourself? Hmm. I would shine a light back there, but then again, that just might entice them to come out. Ta da 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 da. Oh. This must be Evelyn's room. And my light is flickering. My very good, very trusty light is flickering. Hmm. Which can only mean one of two things. Either the battery is dying, or something very paranormal is about to fucking unfold on our asses. I would say it's very paranormal, as that just shot right up my ass. I felt it creep way up there. My family, my family, my family, my family. Evelyn. Signed, dated, love, Evelyn. You're hiding in here, aren't you? What did you do to this family, little girl? Where are you? Oh. Just going to close that. Somebody has an obsession with baby dolls. Just like their mother. I touched your teddy bear! What are you going to do about it? As it rocks in the paranormal spectrum. Ooh. Shipwreck. All the family died. Hello. Evelyn. There's only so far that you can run. And if I put a 
bullet in your head, does that end all this turmoil? What was that? This room is filled with nothing but burnt babies. Yes, babies. That's what I was going to say. Something's wrong with her. Oh yeah, something really is wrong with her. Have you seen her baby dolls? Her baby doll collection? I think she's a little obsessed. If you don't mind me saying. And I don't think anybody really does at this point. Oh. Evelyn, you're making my light flicker again. Are you in here? I believe you might be. I'm closing doors behind me, so that way you can't get away. I'm... Stay away. Why? Evelyn, I just want answers, okay? Nothing more? That whole thing about putting a bullet in your head? Even though I'm aiming straight down the hallway. That is what you call uh, exaggeration. I was merely joking. Yes, joking. You know, for being the one that gave them immortality, why are you living like this? You would think that they would make you live a little bit more luxuriously. There's nobody in there. There's no dolls or nothing. Right behind something. Where? Uh, I think there's something I'm missing here. Because this, this is clearly a document of the room I'm in right now, and there's something behind the bed. But when I look behind the bed, there's nothing. And Evelyn, why don't you turn a damn light on, girl? Oh. It's a throne for a corpse. A corpse of Evelyn? A D-series arm. What is wrong with her? Her entire body is off proportion. And why is it labeled as a D-series arm? Oh, God. I guess this is it. I mean, it's gotta be. It's labeled as a D-series, so... That's the only explanation that there is. Hello. Evelyn, are you, are you coming here to say hello? You have psychic powers, don't you? You're not really dead. You're just petrified in this state, and you wish to tell me hello. Okay. Sure. Run into a wall. What the fuck did you do to this room, young lady? Okay! Cool! Cool! We're playing that game, huh? Well, you know what game I like to play? The, uh, Run Past the Creature game. Yeah. That's a good one. I like that game. The fuck was that? It's all like a shadow for a second. Nope. Sorry, Evelyn. We're not playing that game today. I'm just gonna run past everybody because... Because I have literally no ammo for this shit. Ah, oh, my eye. Young lady, we're not playing this game, okay? I knew you would call. Something in my freaking bones just told me you would call. I got it. And it's Are disgusting. Are really gonna be able to make serum with this thing? It'll be fine. After we make it, we can get out of here. Yeah, there should be enough for you and I'll me, all right? All right. Now oh, we get to finally see you, huh? Get to finally see what you look like. 
Okay. Well, let's do it then. I'll meet you there. With only six rounds in my pistol and lots of burner ammo. I could have burned the creatures. But again, like I said, what's the point in wasting the ammo when you can just play the run past the fucking horrifying creature game? Oh boy. Oh. That's cool. My game kind of spaced out for a second there. Kind of had an issue with loading. All right. Zoe, you were in here, right? God damn it, woman. I don't like this over the phone relationship. Now where the hell are you? You know, never mind. Yeah, never you mind. You need the head and you've got it. And this is going to help me and me, right? Hey, buddy. I thought you oh. know. I decided that Zoe needed a time out. She and Mia are here with me. And they're keeping each other company. Just let them both go. What do you need them for? Nah, uh, uh, that's family business, Ethan, and not your concern, understand? But I thought I was daddy. Now, if you want the head, feel free to come by any time and I'll give it to you. But only if you participate in a little uh, activity I've put together just for you. I don't what like this guy. Oh, 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 I know you're excited, but don't worry. It's not going anywhere. First step I need you to take, <laughs> partner. It's for you to take a peek inside the fridge in the trailer there. Fuck you. Oh, the, come the fridge? Now, don't be like that. What'd you put in there? You wanna have fun, don't you? Now, look in the fridge. Okay, I'll look in the fridge. Bet you I won't be excited about what's in the fridge, now will I? Here we go. Oh, it's the head. It's... A mutated head with a mouth. With a note on the back. The pig is waiting for you in the dissection room, bitch. How dare you call me such a foul word. The pig. Pig. What pig is he talking about? Huh. I don't even know. I have no clue what he's talking about. Oh man, everything is just going downhill, isn't it? Uh, anyways, I think that's where I'm going to wrap up the video. Things have gone to shit. Mia and Zoe have both been kidnapped by what can only be classified as the douchebag of the family. And things are horrible. We have to get to the bottom of this, and quickly, before everybody ends up dying. I really, really need to figure out what is going on over here. There's like a goddamn party going on in there now. What are these, by the way? Pills that affect the nervous system can't be used as is. Make them into a medicine first. What the fuck? Anyways. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this, and if you have, don't forget to shoot the like button to keep it awesome. And as always, don't forget to stay awesome, because you are awesome. And I'll catch you in the next whatever I do. Ciao!